We should probably get a scene with us together. But the lion, because I'm literally the only person all day you didn't get a scene with. Yeah, you were not. Oscar, we like the theme for your press conference. What's up, brother? We like the theme for your press oh, conference. Oh yeah, brother, we're taking we're taking we're taking Mexico Latino night to Riyadh. So thank you, Your Excellency. Actually, everybody should be thanking His Excellency because he's making possible these big fights that fans want to see. So we're actually gonna build a mini Mexico in Riyadh. Imagine that. So I can't wait to see this. Most importantly, this will be for free. Free. Oscar, obviously you put a lot of thought into it, but is it, is it hard to wrap your head around it and enjoy it with this lawsuit that's come up from Devin Haney? Is, 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 wait, wait, wait. Is, is it any, is any, is that any hard to wrap your head around what's going on with this fight, with the news of Devin Haney suing you? Oh, Golden that's, Boy that's, that's just whispers in the ear. That's just noise. That's all it is. What we're here to do is be positive and promote Riyadh season, yeah. Latino nights in Riyadh. This, it's incredible, it's amazing. Yeah. It's amazing because it'll be, it'll be an all Golden Boy show with all Golden Boy fighters fighting each other in Riyadh and it's the first time it's ever happened. You know, normally promoters come together, they work together, no. Golden Boy Promotion has so many fighters that we're matching up our own fighters to give you guys a great show. Yeah. Hey, Oscar, what's next for Ryan? I just had him in my office uh, 30 minutes ago. Big plans for him coming back. You know, obviously, we have to deal with this frivolous lawsuit that, that, that they slapped on us, but that's all it is, is noise. That's all it is. How can you sue somebody that beat the crap out of you? You know, it's like, it just doesn't make sense. And uh, Would look. you as a fighter ever even consider doing that back in your heyday? No, what I would do is call that fighter out, get back in the ring, and beat his ass. Is that the biggest rematch of 2025, Haney Garcia? Uh, biggest I, fight? I don't think so because I believe that Devin Haney is a shot fighter. You think he'll take the fight if it's offered? Of course, because it's for a lot of money. Will we see Ryan in Japan in December? Don't know yet. Don't know yet. We're, it's on the cards uh, though, huh? We're figuring it out as we speak. <laughs> um, first thing is first, we gotta get Ryan back, back to the place where he belongs and that's like just in the gym. Where I, look, I saw him right now, he's in great spirits, he's doing awesome, he's focused. What happened in the past, he's learned, He's he's grown as it as a, as a young man and I gave him a good nice little speech today about my experiences and how I've been through hell and back I walked through Dia de los Muertos and survived it do you right? think now you're... and think about that I'm a I'm a man who has the experience who can tell this young Correct. young man hey it's okay, you're gonna be okay. Is your relationship now, through the turmoil and the bullshit that's happened in the last year, are you and Ryan now closer now than you've ever been? When you do the right thing, when you're positive, when you're honest to your fighters, when you're transparent, guess what? At the end of the day, the good guys always win. All right, thank you.